Hey, my terrific trilobites. I hope you had a really good day. Hope you can read this. Yes, okay. I have no idea how I find all these BH cosmetics. I have no idea. Like, legitimately no idea. But I did find a beauty blender. And I don't have a BH beauty blender. So this is going to go in the Battle of the Beauty Blender video that I'm going to be making in a very controlled setting. Okay, so let's jump in. I found the Color Festival palette. Sorry, I just kind of covered the mirrors because they like, they're really bright with my ceiling light. And this is a gorgeous palette. And it was a whopping $3. $3 for that palette. I found the Opalescent, or Opalescent, depending on where you're from, palette. Completely untouched and or messed up and this one was a little pricey at $12.99 considering the other one was $3 but uh, we'll take it then I found the back to Brazil and I've heard really really good things about this this one was $12.99 and this comes with like some face and cheek highlighters too which is pretty neat. I have no idea that these all existed. There's so many. Then I found the BFF palette. Which is three bucks as well. It's a little bit more plain, I guess, would be my word for it. And then I found a bunch of these. I didn't get them all because that'd be insane. I was actually looking for my birth month, which I could not find. But... And I'm not a big fan of press glitters because I wear contacts and they get stuck in things. But they have a bunch of these for $5.99. And they have a ton of these. A ton of these. Like every year, like the really, really big palettes. <clears throat> this was $8.99. And this one I'm actually kind of excited about because it looks like there's some multi-chromes or dual chromes in there. Like, sorry, the light probably is not helping. But it really looks like some of those might be dual chrome shades depending on the light, and that intrigues me greatly. So, I wanna see how this one plays out. And like I said, this one was only $8.99. They pretty much have all the years, everything. And then I found, for $15, I found the Subculture palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills, which I might be pronouncing that wrong. Yeah, they're down to 15 now. They have this one and the Riviera one and a whole bunch of other ones. I've never actually tried ABH palettes so we're just going to have to see what happens with that and then the last one I picked up is from Cara Beauty and I think I picked it up not just because it was only 10 bucks but because the, first of all this packaging is absolutely stunning 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 packaging this is the stroke of midnight and these shades are unreal I mean, those are absolutely gorgeous. Like, I am very excited to play with this palette, actually. So, we will see what happens. I'm not going to do a get ready with me, as we've seen. I just end up swatching things on my head. So, we're going to avoid that. But, yeah, this is what is currently um, available at Marshall's. And that's it, you guys. Uh, happy BH Cosmetics hunting. See you soon. Subscribe!